Hey guys, Go Shuki here. Um, today we picked up the Pocket Juice uh, portable charger for the Nintendo Switch. I got it on a Black Friday deal from Best Buy, um, and I thought we could unbox it and kind of check it out and see if it's if it's worth it. Um, it's supposed to double your game time. You can charge your Switch while you play, um, so it's good for on the go. And um, let's take a look at it. So this is the front of the box. Um, so looks pretty interesting. It kind of clips on the back of your Switch. has a big built-in kickstand, which is hopefully better than this kickstand that the Switch has on on it already. Um, so yeah, let's um, let's take a look at some of the sides here. Portable juice, or I'm sorry, pocket juice, portable charger. There's the bottom. Uh, there's the side. So it's 10,000 milliamps or milliamps or whatever you call them. Um, here's the back. So two times two times your game time, uh, play while you charge, dock style, so it clips on kind of like a dock, um, prevents it from overcharging, so you don't have to worry about your switch burning out or anything, has vent holes in it, anti-slip grip, um, it includes the charger, uh, micro USB cable, and instruction manual, um, so cool, let's go ahead and open her up and see what we got in here. All right, let's get this box open. I already cut the tape. Um, I'm just gonna pop the top off here and slide it out. All right, so we got some some papers here. We got a warning because it's a lithium-ion battery; it could explode, etc. Um, so we'll set that aside, and then we got a a manual. So it tells you how to use it and charge it. Cool, cool. Um, so here it is. Um, the, you can see I already got my fingerprints showing on it, um, but this is a pretty big battery. I feel like it's going to be bulky on the Nintendo Switch. Um, so here's the USB-C port where the Switch goes in. This kind of goes over the top. We got vents. You can see my fingerprint again. Uh, we got a micro USB to charge it, and we actually got a USB out. So you can actually charge another device outside of the, the Switch. Uh, you got your power button, which the thing comes fully charged, which is kind of cool. And um, nothing on the other sides or bottom. And then on the back, we have the uh, kickstand, which is a pretty solid kickstand. It feels good. I think this one's going to hold the switch up pretty well. Let's set that down. Let's move this side. Let's set this down without the switch. Oh, yeah. I like that stand. And here's the little tiny, tiny micro USB cable. Um, probably the smallest one I've ever seen that came with it. So there you have it. Um, pretty basic things that came with it. Um, so let's go ahead and uh, we're going to grab our switch and hook it up. Okay, so I got my switch, um, and you can see all my fingerprints on it. Don't worry about that. Um, so we're going to put it in here. Okay, that snaps in there like that. And then we can, this one kind of kind of fits nice on there. Okay. All right, so we're going to go into the switch, um, get out of the Japanese eShop <laughs> from my other video. So first off, I do notice it is rather bulky. Um, it's going to take some getting used to playing, but playing it on the go, I mean, shouldn't be too bad. Um, here's the power button on the side. It's on. It's charging the switch. You can't tell because the switch is 100% right now. So, um, But it is full. It is charging it. Um, so that's pretty cool. Um, let's go ahead. Is it on? Yeah, it's charging. Okay. Just wanted to be sure. So yeah, it is heavy. Um, it, it's not too, too bad. Um, I can see myself getting used to it. I don't use it like that so much. So let's, let's pop out the kickstand here and feel how that is. Oh yeah, that is way better than the one that's built into the switch. So definitely a bonus for this is, is using that kickstand. Cause that's going to, makes it so much more sturdy. Um, I don't feel like it's going to fall over if I touch it. Here's kind of a different angle so you can see how sturdy it is. Um, yeah, it's definitely not falling over easily, so I, um, I approve of the kickstand, um, if anything. We're going to load up some Mario, Mario Odyssey, and kind of see how it feels playing it in portable mode like this. Um, again, definitely a bulky, but I, it's, it's not too bad. Um, so we're going to run around, just jump a bit. Um, hmm. Okay, I mean, I could I could see using this um, for a little bit. My arm might get tired after a long period of time, but I mean, I could set it down with the kickstand. 
So yeah, definitely. Um, I'm like kind of liking this battery. Um, it's nice. It gives you a lot more gameplay time on the go without having to plug, look for a wall plug or anything like that. Um, it's bulky, but it doesn't feel too, too bulky. It's got a pretty awesome kickstand. It's also got that USB port if you're with a friend and they need to charge their phone or you need to charge your phone, something like that. So I would definitely recommend it if you have the money and if you use the Switch on the go a lot. But otherwise, just wanted to show this off. Um, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff, and go Shuki out.